We got a fish on, baby. Oh my gosh, that was awesome. Nice salmon. Nice fish. That's what I'm talking about. Using a nymph without an indicator. Oh my gosh, it's small. Oh. <laughs> That's a pretty nice salmon. All right, he's getting tired now. Yes, we got him in the net. Oh my gosh, that's a beautiful salmon. Look at the spots on that thing. Oh my gosh, beautiful fish. I don't know. Beautiful, beautiful fish. He's got my net all wrapped up. Freaking go, yes. Oh, let's go. Welcome back everyone. As you can tell, I'm fly fishing. Uh, I just got that nice 18 inch fish. What a, just a beautiful salmon. Uh, we're here fishing uh, West Grand Stream, or Grand Lake Stream. And uh, that is the second fish of the trip so far. We got here yesterday with two friends of mine. We spent the night in the back of our trucks. And uh, we fished some yesterday and I got this beautiful 21 inch salmon yesterday uh, on a white golden retriever that I tie myself and sell. Uh, and so yeah, I'll put some footage of that in. I yes. And I didn't get all of it on video, but I got some of it. So I'll add some of that footage in and uh, it was just a beautiful fish. And then that one just now is just so awesome. But so that's only the second fish of the trip so far. Uh, but it's been such a beautiful hot weekend. And uh, yeah, I'm so I'm so excited to catch some more fish. So I'm gonna keep working down this river here, and uh, hopefully try to pick up a couple more fish before we have to go. What a beautiful stream! With that sun coming up, just a beautiful spot. Got another fish on. Taking me right into the current. Nice salmon. Another nice fish. I gotta get him out of Oh! Yes! No! <laughs> My net is way too small for these fish. Got him. Got him. Yes! Let's stink and go. Look at that fish. Another beautiful fish. This is actually, yeah, this one's a stocked one. He doesn't have any clipped fins, but those fins are really stubby. But hey, it's still a fish. Nice salmon. First, let's get a good look at that fish. Beautiful, beautiful salmon. Pops right out. 17 inch here, there he goes. Yes, that's awesome. So in case you guys are wondering what my setup is, I have a, a nine foot six weight yellow bean rod and uh, I just have floating line on it right now. And I'm using a stone fly. I'm just kind of letting it drift down and I'm not using any indicators. And I'm just keeping tension on it so I can feel if there's a bite or not. But that's what I'm doing so far and that's what 
uh, has caught those last two fish. Yesterday, I was using a white golden retriever. Uh, and that worked good too for, I had another bite on it, but I lost one. But yeah, that's my setup so far. I literally, it literally touched his head. It's not very big. Yep. I guess it's bigger than 16. No. Just stocked one. Nice fish. Got him on the stone fly again. Look, look, he's right in front of you. <laughs> Man, it puts a little bit more of a bend in your rod than the trout do it. That looks like another stock one. No, no, you you got. <laughs> Get your line off. Yeah. Is your line off? All right. Lively guy. He's got scars on his back. I just saw my indicator go under. Because I was looking at the suckers again, and then I just looked at my indicator. Uh, fourth today, fifth total, yeah. I love how it cleared, as you can see him so good. Yes! Bigger than that last one. Stock one. All right, that's probably close to 19. There he goes. Cool. 